Hey Wildcats, Miss Jacobson here, um, principal of West High School. And I'm Miss Kister, I'm the activities director at West High School. So we're here to give you some opening announcements for the beginning of the school year. We're super excited for this upcoming school year and some uh, great things are taking place. I can tell you some great things have already taken place. We had an amazing turnout for registration. Um, over 600 um, students and their families came through for registration. Uh, that is a huge number. Thank you for Wildcats for making that happen. And speaking of the school year, we're going to start on September 1st with freshmen only. So we only want to see those shiny new faces here um, bright and early. Um, school starts, we open the doors at 7. Um, and so we kind of expect students to get here between 7 and 7.15. We have breakfast in the morning, so you can go down and get some. Um, they usually have like Pop-Tarts and yogurt, okay? And then we'll start off with some tours. And then September 2nd is all other students coming in. Um, there aren't going to be um, too many changes except for one, and that is these are back. You have to wear your masks. That's all there is to it. There is no exception to it. All adults, everybody is wearing a mask when they come into the building until further notice. And every day you have to do a health screener. We have QR codes up around the building where you can just scan them and then your health screener will come up and you can fill it out. We also have a link on the page that you can link to for your health screener. And finally, one final announcement, we have a DACA classroom at Subaru Adopted West High School. We're excited that um, they're donating some money so that we can get some excellent equipment, uh, activity-based kind of things for these classrooms. And the following staff members have been the ones that were adopted. Lindsay Ripple, Bobby Joe Sarnich, Max Wereshofer, Greg Sawyer, Lisa Merkel, and Bonnie Gonzalez. Congratulations, teachers, and we look forward to to seeing what they add to their classroom with this Adopt the Classroom. And thank you, Subaru. We appreciate it greatly. We're here um, with the AD to kind of talk about fall sports and how that's shaping up. Yeah, we're off to an exciting start with the fall sports season. Our volleyball team has already done tryouts uh, and they had an excellent turnout there. Um, we could still use a few players for our football team our soccer, our boys soccer team, that started last week, Monday. Um, our girls tennis team is looking for numbers and cross country is always looking for runners. So if you are interested in, and you still wanna participate, either contact one of the coaches or you can reach out to me here at West. What's the benefit of doing a fall sport? What are your thoughts? Well, I think just getting to meet new people and spending time with um, making new friends um, and plus you also getting into shape and um, just being part of a team is is something that I know most of these players look forward to. Yeah. Um, what do you do for cross country? Cross country, they go to all different parks and they're running through forests and hills and things like that. It's just more of a nature thing. Oh, and is it more distance running? More distance running, mm -hmm. yeah. They um, do a 5K, I believe. Okay, that's and that's about three miles, right? Okay, all right. And then for boys soccer, I'm, I'm understanding that we really do need the numbers to come up for that. For yeah, that. and this year they've had more okay. students who have shown interest, but it's a matter of also registering online for the sport as well as getting a physical. Mm -hmm. And you know, those are some of the things that are taking athletes a little bit longer to take care of. What if, what if I, like my mom's not gonna pay for me to get a physical? then um, we can stop at the main office here and I have a physical waiver that I can give them. Yeah, so they can go to any Bellin walk-in clinic and they wouldn't be charged for the physical. For the physical. Okay. That's awesome, that's very cool. The new um, dance coach too, and right? That's correct. Coach Borley 
and she's excited to be the dance coach here and she is having a few open clinics that are coming up and so if you're interested in dance uh, feel free to show up for those. Well Wildcats we're looking forward to seeing you on um, September 1st and looking forward to seeing all of you on September 2nd. Um, you guys have a great day and stay safe.